What's up, everybody? Welcome back to another episode. I'm Roggle here with Sig, and get ready to go down the weird rabbit hole or dark crevice of a canyon that is his mind. Because he has a topic for today, and I'm not quite sure what it is, but going off of how the past episodes have been for him, be prepared for a monkey fucking a football on this one, because it's going to get interesting, more than likely. Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa. Tell me I'm wrong, because you can say whoa one more time. I'm a monkey fucking a fuck. Okay. It's more like a dolphin fucking a Okay. Two animals. Not an internet object. All right. So. Whatever you're into. So. I. I have some interesting stuff. Too I'm much a, time on your hands. So much time on my hands. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> but, yeah. Uh, so, here's what we're going to do. Or here's what you're going to do. Fuck. This is a single punishes rival torture type thing. I got this idea from TikTok, from another clip of another podcast. That was like funny. So, I'm going to torture him with it. But, to stay in true fashion with us, um, we're going to be talking about trivia. But here's, here's, here's the part, okay? Here's the part. I have a huge list ranging from A to Y. And I got decades, too. So this can be like 40s, 50s, 60s, 70s, 80s, 90s, 20, or sorry, 2000, 2010s. Uh, trivia. We got 4th of July trivia. We got animal, ancient history, American cuisine. Boy band trivia, How I Met Your Mother, WWE, nutrition, plants, novels, uh, Sherlock Holmes, historical, mythical, president, supernatural, superhero, Marvel, DC. I got a shit ton of trivia. The best part for me, other than seeing how stupid you are, again, there's no map. I like there's one map. <laughs> what? We'll try not to do that one. The ones I will tell you we will absolutely not do um, is the Kardashian trivia. I don't give a shit about. Um, there was another one I just saw over here. Over here. NASCAR. We, 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 I won't torture anybody with that shit. So you're, you're, you're good there. And Justice Spark and Not Cry. Taylor Swift. Fuck that. Now that everyone's ready to come at me, cool. You're going to be oh, given the pleasure. That was fun. Yeah, cancel because <laughs> all the Swifties came at us. You're going to get the pleasure, using that term very, very fucking loosely. You get the pleasure to pick one at a time, A through Y. Keep in mind, there's only one Y category, there's one X category. So if you pick one of those two, that's all you get. So with that said, you can pick one of those, or you can pick a decade. Or, if you can think of a trivia, I'll look to see if it's here. Question okay, by question, so... torment by torment. I got NFL on here, I got boxing, I got candy. So I just say a letter, and you're going to pick from what are one of these random, a question from one of these random. Is it going to change each time? Yeah, it's going to change each time. Okay, so if I say like C, so if you said C, you have it's math. I'm, I'm hanging up right now. We're done. We have about thirty. Thirty you can pick from. So either I can so pick I'm... random, or I'll let you be nice and I can read off a few of them. What if I just picked a number at that point and right, I just so went down one to through, that one through twenty nine? Okay, give me 15. Christmas trivia. Fuck. Hey, yeah, we already did a Christmas trivia, so you should know. Yes, we did. You should, you should know. You should know. It's, um, I think I did fairly well on that one, too. I, think, I kind of remember you did too. It's like I remember you you did really well and you lost it all because you got stupid. Uh, I think I won that one to be honest. 
Look, we'll start off easy. We'll start off easy. Easy. In the movie, Home Alone, what is the name of the character who accidentally got left behind by his family who went on vacation? First and last name. Kevin. McAllister. There we go. See? Easy peasy. He's one and one, you all. One and one. And and you know, where's that where's that at? Do I have do I have a clapping one? I think I have a clap maybe not. Okay, maybe. Yeah, look, I have claps. It's okay, you won't hear. It's only on oh. our side. My side. Oh. Uh, do I have a blue boo? No, I don't. Okay. Alright. A through Y or a decade. From 40s to 2010s. E. Tango. Tango. Do, 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 do. Wait, well, so these are 10 each. So 10, 20. You got 23. 1 through 23. 4. Thanksgiving trivia. Oh, Hold on. There's also a Big Bang tri Theory trivia. You want to test your hand at that? Since you watch a sure. lot of Big Bang? Be nice. I, I can be nice. I start getting them right. I know. Fuck that. <laughs> <laughs> what is the name of Sheldon's favorite TV show? Professor Proton. Wrong. <laughs> You want to try that again? He's thinking. I want to say Star Trek, but it's not. Two thousand years later. I can't think. Because like Battlestar, I don't think is it. Because I think they shit on Battlestar, or he did. Firefly? Hmm. What is it? Yeah. It's, it's, I don't know how loud that is actually. It's, it's Doctor Who. I don't know how they picked it as his favorite. It said this was established in season two. That's all it's telling me. One for two. Okay. I guess one one. Yeah. Mm, alpha. What? Alpha? Alpha. I, I heard Opa. I was like, the fuck? Opa. <laughs> Opa. You got, you got 22. Uh, nine. Animal trivia. You know, it's kind of funny I'm thinking about this too. Is I'm like, man. It's kind of easy, but like, I could really just fuck with you and be like, I know you said nine, but I want this one. There's a lot of integrity going on over here. That's what the Air Force is telling us. He has a Venn diagram and everything. That makes sense. All right. Um, do, 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 do. No, that's too easy for you. The St. Bernard breed of dogs is needed to which European country? Switzerland. That would be correct. 2-1. That was fucking time. Okay. Uh -huh. oh. Again, didn't know that through, one at all. Through Y, and you got decades <laughs> too. Uh, so nineties. Nineties. You can do general, artists, hits, female oh. singers, boy bands, rock hits, pop groups, band trivia, artists and their hits, or miscellaneous. Do miscellaneous. Okay. I don't. Say that word. In 1991, Gloria Estevan was coming out of the what?
Um, I'm going to let you all know right now. I have no fucking idea. I have the answer. I'm like... Coming out of the... Yeah. Technically, yeah. I gave you the word the. Oh. So there's one word left. 91. Closet. No idea. I mean, you're kind of close. Dark. Hmm. Coming out of the dark. Okay. Again, I don't know. I wonder if that's a movie. Oh, what? You know what a movie? It's a song. Yeah, it's probably one of her tours. No, it's a song. It's oh, but yeah. Yeah, let's see if I know it. You listen to a lot of Gloria Stefan? I listen to a lot of music, just in general, so. Yeah. Yeah, like, side note. I was door dashing today, and I was listening to uh, Say a Little Prayer for You. It just came on the, the AI playlist. So I'm kind of into that, where it's just like, oh, let's pick out a song based upon all the shit you listen to. But anyways, do you know that song? You're older, mm-hmm. so you should know that song. Okay. Anyways. Just want to clarify. Because this person did not. Or okay. We're three seasons in. Everybody knows that at this point. <laughs> anyway, so the order was to a location, that, and the instructions said, text me when you get here, so I can come out and get the counter. She's like, cool, whatever. So I text her. And she comes out. She's about mid-40s, early 50s, at least. And I open the door. I have my music a little bit loud. And she just goes... You know this song is before our times, right? A little insulted because she said our time, like I was the same age as her. I did not look the same age as her. At all. Or- Anyways, so I was like, yeah, so this is a good song. It's a classic song. I like the song. It's a classic oldies. My great grandma used to listen to this. And my first thought was, you fucking cunt. Shut your mouth. How dare you say such <laughs> atrocities to my face? I was, I was a little, I got a little offended. <laughs> grandma, I would be like, cool, whatever. Great grandma was insulted. It's true. Not just two old generations, song. it's three generations. <laughs> old. It's an old fucking song. Yeah, and yet you're older than me. And always will be. You, uh, yes, that's, that's true. I will always be. All right. Give me Delta. You got 11. Nine. Okay. (laughs) I'm sticking, all these two have, um, like, easy, medium, hard. I'm sticking everything with easy. I want to give you a fighting chance. To a degree, of which you could be. Anyways, just so you know. All right, let me. Which dog breed is named for? Sorry, which dog breed's name is French for a butterfly? And if anybody's watched Fancy Nancy, you know this. Sharp, hey. Uh, no. No. What is it? No idea. Papillon. That's a dog? I guess so. <laughs> I'm doing the same thing you Papillon? are. Papillon? <laughs> yeah. Do you need me to spell it? Happy. I'm just going to assume it's how it's... it's... Oh. I did not know this. What the... The P A P I L L O N? Yeah. It's a tiny little dog. Yeah, it's that uh, little fucking ugly thing. Yeah. That's an insulting name. That's what they're called? I guess so, yeah. Huh. I didn't know that. That's okay. an insulting name. I don't, I don't like the word Papillon anymore. I, I didn't know you. I didn't even know that was a name. 
I had to watch Fancy Nancy with my kids. So, boy, that's one of her favorites. Fuck is Fancy Nancy? I don't Disney know what that one's either. Uh, I don't know what is Fancy Nancy is. It was really big during COVID for my kids. Oh, your house. Hey. No. Hey. And you know what? It took one show to dethrone all that other shit. Fancy Nancy, Puppet Babies, uh, Vampirina. It took one show. And it's a fucking amazing show. Bluey? Bluey. <laughs> fucking right, Bluey. Gosh. Hey, you shut your mouth. Problems. <laughs> Problems. The problem is, is Bandit is too good of a dad. I'm not gonna stop you from choosing the same letter over again, by the way, because that's just too hard to keep track of. Alright. Like bounce around though. Uh Mike. I like to start giving you numbers just right away. It's like Mike twelve. If there's not twelve, then just tell me. No, there's there's F twelve. One, two, three, four. They're just kinda speed up a little bit. There's twenty, but if you want twelve, that's fine. Eight. Yeah. Modern Family Trivia. Do you watch Modern Family? See it? I have not. Oh. Uh, the star of Modern Family, Ed O'Neill, was born in which decade? He's older than you. Not by much, though. It was in the... Forties. Nineteen forties. How the fuck did you know that? He's 78 years old. You just went, he's... He's almost 40 years older than me in one second. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> Tell me I'm wrong. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> this is gonna be a little bit of a shorter episode too, y'all so Alright, uh Tango six. Tango again, alright. Six. Oh, can't do that one. That one's big bang theory. Uh Yankee seven. Only one Yankee. So Oh okay. YouTube trivia. Logan Paul. Jake Paul. <laughs> Pedophiles. Oh my gosh, five one I think you may know. A popular video on YouTube features a clip from various movies that makes a word to what song? Um this would be like OG YouTube as well, by the way. There are a lot of those. I have no idea. Baby got back. Oh, really? Oh. <laughs> no idea on that one. That was the other one I thought you would know. <laughs> oh, no, I have no idea. I never even knew of the thing. Uh, let's see. Let's do Echo One. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Okay. How do you feel about early art? Oh, I, I love it. I dabbled in early art. All about. Yeah, I call it, I told it when I was little. Outside of the. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Do you really know any? Oh, no. Uh, well, no, no. Not enough to answer any questions. I've seen more than I know, but. Uh, like, I've been to. I've been to big museums. Anyways. um, I'm torn between two questions. So. I'm going to lay 
No, but that is the answer down below that I wasn't going to let you have. <laughs> um, how many parts are there to the to Dante's Divine Comedy? Yeah, 32. <laughs> fucking off like you're not even like, in a I hope ballpark so. i don't even know you're not even in a ballpark of 20. i know you said Devante. i know you said dante sure sure dante's inferno cool okay seven levels left now yeah okay three the answer is three that's what i said with the two behind it uh, yeah <laughs> with the two behind it <laughs> yeah not the same though. Not the same. You were ten percent right. Okay. So I was looking for it. Just ten, that's all you need. <laughs> <laughs> all right, letter number. Give me the eighties. Ooh. You have four choices. You have general, music, movies, and TV. Movies. I knew you'd do movies. Ah, oh, too easy. It's the only one I think I have a chance too at. Too easy. Too easy. Oh my god, these are fucking easy. There's questions like, who's the main character of Back to the Future? Who played Martin McFly Back to the Future? Who played Indiana Jones? Who directed E.T.? Yeah, no, these are way too easy, so give me a second. Here we go. Which film won the Academy Award for Best Picture? <laughs> Too hard? <laughs> <laughs> go ahead. Who won? <laughs> Which film won the Academy Award for Best Picture in 1982? Picture like a year before I was born. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh... okay. Okay. I'll give you an easier one. You're not going to know that. I want to know the answer, though. Gandhi. Oh. Yeah, you did. Like yeah. And a diaper. <laughs> All right. Who played the character Sarah Connor in the film Terminator, released in 1984? I'll give you a hit. I'll give you a hit. Give you a hint. Two names. What's her name? Two thousand years later. Um, mm -mm. no Google. I can't think. I can't. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna go new here in a second. Uh, can't think what the hard name is. Starts with an L. Last name starts with an H. Last name is a fairly popular play as of the last 10 years. Linda Hamilton. There we go. There is that her name? Yeah, Linda Hamilton. I was like, Laura, Lisa. Becky, Stacy. That was so smart with else. Yeah, but you're not smart, so it's fine. Who else do you got? What else do you got? Are you typing Discord? Uh, Why is my background there? Okay. My, my dog are sitting there in their camera and they're like scratching at the pad. So it's like driving me nuts. They never do that. Someone tell her they're doing. Sick of your shit. Uh, <laughs> No, I couldn't remember Linda Hamilton. Who the hell it is, but I couldn't. Look, they even had Bluey trivia. But I could have got without the hint she gave me. Uh, yeah, let's see. Welcome. I'll still give it to you. How high did the decades go? 20 things. Let's see. Next, let's do. 
uniform 10. <laughs> There's eight. Hey, give me eight. These are going to be hard. You want eight? Yeah. US TV trivia. US what? TV. Oh, they said US treaty. Like, oh, fuck. Like, no. I changed my mind. Six. Six. <laughs> I, I said seven. <laughs> oh my god. Um, let's see. Just to be a dick. Oh no, I wouldn't expect anything else. As of 2013, how many seasons of Days of Our Lives has there been? I swear to God, if you fucking get this one right, I'm gonna give you so much shit for watching. So 2013. Yes. Fifty-three. So close. I mean that. You are so close. You went over. Not by much. You're a lot closer here than you were with Dante's Divine Comedy. 47. He was close. He watches soaps, y'all. He watches soaps. I will do a few more. Um, I have a couple of them that I'm going to pick out at the end if you don't get to. For shit to give us. Anyway, you do the last five. You want me to do the last five? You pick the last five. All right, yeah. World of Warcraft trivia. Okay, I'll do. I'll pick. <laughs> Fuck. Yeah, go ahead. Ask me this bullshit question. No. Yes, the movie sucked. Next question. The movie did not suck. It could have been so much worse. Yes, it right. did. You fucking know damn well it sucked. I liked it. I think that's probably it. I'm going to do some video game trivia. Uh, do, 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 do. Easy, easy, easy. Well, let's just, I can jump around. What the fuck I'm doing? Uh, classic game trivia. All right. Right up Roggle's alley because he's old as shit. The Donkey Kong arcade game by Nintendo was introduced in what year? Say it again. The Donkey Kong arcade game by Nintendo was introduced in what year? Two thousand years later. 19. You're half white. 87. Nope. I'll give you one more shot. I'm going to give you a clue. Before you were born. Not by much. 74. That is way more than not by much. Way more. That's <laughs> not by much. There's a. There's a lot of years. God damn. Before I was born. 1981. Oh. Like, not long before. It's like, you know, one to five years, maybe. Not ten. Nine. We round up. If you can't count, we round up. All right. I will be nice. Uh, Super Bowl trivia. Because you're big into the football. I didn't mean to say the football. I meant to just say football. <laughs> you're big into that there football sport. Ah, <laughs> uh, sports. Already... <laughs> 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 All 
Ah, the football. A <laughs> football, you know that one. <laughs> all right. All right. Uh, this is all about the Super Bowl. Okay. Ooh. I gotta choose one like I can kind of sound like I know what the fuck I'm talking. How good is your memory on games and scores? I'm not gonna tell you a fucking score. Okay. All I can tell you is the lead that the that the Atlanta Falcons blew. In the Super Bowl twenty four to three, and then they lost that game. Okay. I don't know the final score. No, I won't be able to tell you scores. That much of a fucking nerd. Yeah. There's a lot of these like what's the what was the final score? I was like, I don't know if you would know these. Oh, fuck. No, I wouldn't remember that. <laughs> so I, have to, I have to find ones that are not about score. Or how many were in attendance. All right. I'm trying to be nice on this. To a degree. I, I am. But I don't want to be, I don't want to come across as like a super dick. Just kind of a dick. All right, now you, you, were care about you were alive and you were almost 10. So maybe you would know this. I'll actually I'll go up even sooner. This comes from 2007. Who was the winner? Oh, God, I hope I'm getting this number right. Sorry, who was the losers of the Super Bowl 41 in 2007? XLI. Yeah, that's 41. X means 10 before L, L is 50. <laughs> what are you asking me? Who lost? Yeah, who lost in 2007? Oh, fucking no. Um, let's see, Brady's probably still playing at that point. No, he's not. He's not playing. Uh, 2007. A loser in 2007. I'm going to go with Oh shit. Um the Would Steelers. You like to... Would you like to know the the teams? Sure. Indianapolis Colts, Chicago Bears. Oh, the Bears. Yep. I think they won since the, it's what, 84? It's the 80s? Cornelius, yeah. The All year right. the Super Bowl shuffles. <laughs> And of course, to be a super dick. Where are you at? Where are you at? There we go. <laughs> this one's going to make me really happy. Man, be a dick. Let's just look at this right. Are you ready for this? What's wrong with it? Yeah, go ahead. Spit your venom. What is the distance around the circle called? Circumference. Are you sure? Radius. Are you sure? No. You gotta pick one. I will let you know. One of those is right. Circumference. Good job. And now on to the real question. <laughs> it's just a warm up. It's a lead into. It really is. Millie gets 68 out of 80 questions right on her exam. What is the percentage that she got right? 68 out of 80? Yep. 
I hate you so much. <laughs> I fucking hate you. <laughs> and you know this. You've gotten way too many of these right. 78%. You're so close. It was right there. 85. What is it? Yeah. <laughs> Almost 10. We'll see. That was a B. All right. Nope, I should. Fast food question. You just gotta pick the restaurant, okay? Okay. What restaurant offers the famous Star Burger? Carl's Jr. Correct. What chain is the only one to offer a special Mountain Dew? Taco Bell. What is the, what's the name of that drink? All right. And lastly, oh, I was a shit. <laughs> you know what? Do you want to talk shit? Now? Look, I, I chose easy questions. <laughs> like this will be fun. It's fine. It's fine. Nope. Fuck you. Let's go. Which chain introduced the first ever kids meal with a toy? First. Ever. McDonald's. You sure about that? Yeah. I think it's have to wait to find out and see if you got it right. Then you listen to the episode and hear the sound effects. <laughs> you motherfucker. <laughs> I can Google it right now. <laughs> McDonald's would be correct. And then wrap this one off. Which fast food chain is known for its square fish sandwich? Square fish sandwich? McDonald's. Arby's. McDonald's is square as well. Yes, but they're not known for their square fish sandwich. Arby's is known for its legit square fish sandwich is the name of their meal. Oh, it's named square fish sandwich? Mm hmm Oh. Not a square fish patty. The square oh, fish I took it as a. Oh, it's called that. Okay. Oh, I know. I know. I know. Have. That's why I chose this one. I didn't know they had one. Who orders a fucking honest, fish sandwich? I, I only get like a couple things from Arby's. And it has to be like, I am just fucking not enjoying life. And that one Arby's. I don't even know what, like, I've had their Reuben. That's not bad. Mm -hmm. Like beef and cheddar is probably the only thing I really will get from there, but that's like there. I will. That meat that. is very questionable. Oh yeah, it's, it's, their orange creamsicle shake is really good. I, I figured you would want something childish. Yes. <laughs> it, it doesn't matter what I get because I, I don't I don't like their curly fries. So. I, I don't like curly fries. You don't like curly fries at all? Not their season. No. Like, just basic, like salt? Sure. Seasoned curly fries? Uh, nope. I don't like, like Hardee's? Fries either. No, not Hardee's. I don't like Hardee's. And that's just like a blanket statement. I don't like Hardee's. I don't like oh. food. Okay. <laughs> their Frisco burger is the only thing I'll eat from there. And that's like. Very rare they even will eat it. All right. Down to the last category, you got three questions. This is all WWE. Going to get them all wrong. Guaranteed. I would hope not. Because these are quite easy. Oh, well, you think so? I think this first Let me one... change your mind. <laughs> <laughs> I think this first one's quite easy. Let me fuck your I'll, mind up I'll, real quick. I'll explain later. In what year did The Undertaker debut in WWE? The 
Undertaker. Not Mark. 1990. Not mean Mark. Mark Undertaker. 1990. Correct. I can't. Yeah. Did you year say year? One. Yeah. Oh shit! I was saying I was I meant to say nineties, but like yeah, nineteen ninety. That's what I meant. I got lucky. That's what I was just saying <laughs> I meant to say nineties, but they came out nineteen ninety. You said yeah. ninety. Yeah. I knew it. All right. Well then, since since you chose to do this or be that big of an asshole, oh, I chose. Darren Matthews is the real name of what WWE superstar? Darren Matthews. Uh, that kid would be a fucking nerd growing up. <laughs> Darren. Let's call him Darren. Darren Matthews. You have two first names. You're a serial killer. Um, I will go with... Darren Matthews. Fucking dork. Um... <laughs> Holy shit. I don't know why that's so funny. <laughs> you were so <laughs> up on dork. Um, 2,000 years. British Bulldog. No, it's David Way Smith. Fuck, I have no idea. Um, and I'm doing this like trying to think of somebody, and I'm having a hard time to think of somebody. And this is like legit WWE, not like everybody's WWE now. No, this is okay. Legit, yeah. Okay, this is OG. He's been with the company for a bit. Tonka. He's a fucking dork. Nope. You want to try? Uh, I feel like once I say this answer, you're gonna be like, oh, "Yeah, that makes sense," because that's why I thought when I read the question too was, "Ah, yeah, that's that makes sense." Big boss man. Nope. No idea. W William Regal. Fucking oh, dark. <laughs> and to round this all up, we start with the Undertaker. We get with the Undertaker. In which WrestleMania did The Undertaker not appear? Don't say anything, Risa. One. That's not the answer here, but that's also oh. true. It says not in one. <laughs> it's also true. Uh, <laughs> I guess I'm assuming during his active yeah. career. <laughs> I was like, well, it wasn't in one. I don't think it was in two either. Um... <laughs> well, oh, hey, it... <laughs> Any more brain teasers? <laughs> During his run, in which year did he not Um, You got me there. Oh my god. Let's see. 23. Nope. Which one? 10. 10. I feel like 1 through probably 6 are on there. Huh. All right. Now that you said that, I need to check one out. Uh, no, he wasn't in one. Trust me. He wasn't there. I know he wasn't in one, but... Ah. So he gave a couple. I mean, other than one. Of course. Uh, says, it begins with WrestleMania 7 in 91. He beat Jimmy Snuka. For the final win and came up against coming up against CM Punk at WrestleMania 29, 2013. The Undertaker was absent only from WrestleMania 10 in 94 and WrestleMania 20 due to ongoing injury. 
So that would have been 10 and 16 during his run. He did have a hmm. point of WrestleMania. We dig into this. It's cute. Well, he did the ones he competed in until he put against Lesnar. Which apparently he wasn't supposed to lose in. But he it is all fucked up. Yep. Yep, he sure was. I'm trying to see if there's any more of these I want to give you just to see for shits and giggles. <laughs> I'm trying to go through all of them. How well do you know your dinosaurs? Not well enough to probably answer any questions. <laughs> right? That, I mean, that's fair. That's, that's fair. Um, I think that may be all of them. I'm sure, we can save a lot of these for another episode. You can torture me on. I got so many of them. I'm sure you do. So I need. I just want to see if there's anything. Oh no, that's gonna be too hard. So yeah, that's all of them. For now. I went down a rabbit hole and saw a Big Bang one, but I was like, it's called episodes, and you had to name the season and episode something happened in. Oh fuck that! That's hard. Oh well, yeah. That one's gonna be hard. Yeah, the only one I knew was, when did they introduce Penny? I was like, oh, one. <laughs> yeah, I know that one. When did they introduce Bernadette? I don't know. I don't know. The season is. Yeah, that'd be tough. That'd be tough. All right. Well, Very that's, tough. that's all we got. That's all the torture for Roggle. That's fine. He didn't do too bad. With my assistance, he did. I have to leave hey. the stray dog away, but it's fine. Anyways, yeah, so that's that. Come check us out Thursday nights for our game nights as we play Call of Duty until you know Roggle decides to get his computer that his his significant other bought him eight months ago for his birthday, and he still hasn't uh, opened it. And then we would be playing so World of Warcraft. It is open. There's no World of Warcraft that's going to happen. So, yeah, it's gonna happen. Talking about? Nope. It will. It's fine. We need nope. more games of Call of Duty. It's okay. We got to win at something, nope. and I can win at World of Warcraft all the time. As long as we stay away from PvP. I got, side note, I got completely. There was a very strong word I want to use that we used to use back in the day. I got spanked. I play PvP for the first time in probably five years, probably seven years. <laughs> I'm, I'm hopping to PvP. I need this. I need this token or whatever. It's fine. Those motherfuckers capture the flag. The other team literally were kitted out, and they had two runners, and the other six players would kill everybody and then just camp by the graveyards, and would wipe you before you even. Drop down from the graveyard. So there's a very specific word I want to use that I won't use because it's offensive. But yeah, we were just <laughs> oof. so getting owned left and right, huh? That that is putting it so lightly. I look like if you compare what happened in that match compared to how I normally play in Warzone, I look like a goddamn god in Warzone. That's how bad it is. <laughs> If you want to see what I'm talking about, come join us on Thursday nights. And if you want to see what I'm talking about, World of Warcraft, come join me during the weekdays, during lunch, and see me just get spanked. Worse than a dominatrix. Willingly. So, you know. This is on OnlyFans? Not yet. Are you getting spanked out? I'm going <laughs> to tie that into my live streams, and I'll have it so where people can do redeem points. But they also have to be over on OnlyFans to, you know, see the redeem points happen. The whole system. Watch me here, but see the punishment over here. <laughs> Networking. That's what we'll call it. Oh, yeah, that's yeah, that's what it is. Gotcha. <laughs> okay. 
Anyways. <laughs> yeah, yes, be sure to check us out on Thursdays. <laughs> where we play Call of Duty majority of the time. Anytime, all time. That's all I don't say play. majority of the time. Name one time. Name one motherfucking time we did not play Call of Duty. You can't even say Helldivers, even though I got it after Rod was like, hey, you should get Helldivers. It's pretty fun. We can play it. So, okay, cool. We'll, I'll get it. It'll that game's getting places. shit on left and right now, too, by the way. It's getting shit They're on left shitting right on that game. Since, since PlayStation decided to announce you would have to have a PlayStation account. And it's just been getting worse and worse and worse. Yep, they've destroyed that game. So, yeah. That game will be played. Just like Sony. Sony. Can't blame it all on Sony just because they did it themselves. I can blame it one hundred percent on Sony. Yes, you can. So yes, but we can play Warzone on Thursday nights, and yes, more episodes to come. Life doesn't get in the way. Play it's sensitive. His his his. Have a nice one. Bye, bitch. <laughs>